Hi, I'm Kerry Greenwell with Creekside Mortgage. I want to talk a little bit now about the second quarter of 2022. Um, it's pretty eventful, to say the least, to watch what happens on a day-to-day -day basis. We keep seeing you know, shock and awe, basically, what's going on. We have true double-digit inflation, from what I can tell. Um, we see values to continue to increase, along with rates going up at the same time. So it's not a very fun time to go through, to not knowing what's going to happen in the future. But I'll give you some of it, in my opinion. I, I don't think values are going to drop. I don't think there's a bubble incident happening right now. I know some people have that opinion because they want to relate to what happened in, in 06, 07, you know, leading up to the crash. Um, but unlike at that time to now, we have so few people that own houses and so many people that wish to own houses, and just not enough inventory. So as you can tell, when a house goes up, there's multiple people that want to buy that house. So until you get a, a correction in that, where you get an equal amount of sellers to buyers, it won't correct itself necessarily. Um, when you focus on what's your payment per month versus what you're paying rent, anyone that has kids, grandkids, or anyone else young right now trying to go out and buy a house, it's pretty overwhelming. But it's going to have to do more with what you're, you're comfortable, what your actual payment is, and not necessarily what the rates are and everything else. Because if things go up, those are going to be what you're going to have to concentrate towards. Um, we had some good times. I mean, some unbelievable times in, in years past with what rates did. Um, now we've got tremendous equity in our house. It's what's that next step we do? And if we need to you know, move up into a house or we want to downsize, what do we make sure we do with that portion of money? Um, so there's a lot of opportunity, a lot of things we can go through and have one-on-one -on -one conversations. I'm always here to reach out. Um, the office in Meridian is going great, spending half time there, half time here going back and forth has been really cool. Um, I feel like it's, it's an opportunity all across the board to see how different areas are. Um, from the you know outside states to the inside states, you're watching a lot of different things go on and happen. Um, we wish this year to continue to grow our business. We want to add more states, as we talked about. We can go through new lending on, um, and we're always here. Me and my team want to go through and help you, service you in any way. If you are moving out of state or doing anything else, always call us. Um, we don't obviously do real estate um, stuff like that, but we have options and stuff we can go through and, and show you out of state. We have options of people that can go through and do it. And we'll be adding and expanding upon states. So hopefully it's one of those states we can go through and service you. Or if you come back, we're always here. But I love to help. Anyone can call me any questions anytime. Um, VA will always be my passion, as I tell everyone. But uh, I've told a few of you in the last you know, year, I did more uh, conventional transactions last year than I've done in my previous 25 years. So I've been doing this for a while. Love what I do. Love to go through and do one-on-one -on -one conversations. Always here to reach out and talk to me. I would love to hear your stories and what you think is going to go through and happen. Oh, being open-minded, I think, is a key thing for all of us. Um, just be keep your head on a swivel, be prepared for the next thing. So I um, hope everyone has a wonderful, wonderful rest of 2022, and I'm here, like I said, anytime for you. Thank you.